So you think this is olive oil, right? Wrong. Well, maybe some of it is, but this is actually a classic example of food fraud. The extra virgin olive oils are being switched out with cheap ones yes. and fraudulent to sell something labeled as something else. Why is this fish being mislabeled? Your Parmesan cheese products do not contain any Parmesan cheese. As there was no one brand that stood out as completely safe. Wow, so we can't eat anything. I guarantee you any time a product can be passed off as something more expensive, it will be. It's that simple. Counterfeits, dilution, substitution, and mislabeling. Food fraud not only harms consumers' wallets, it puts their health and safety at risk. We might not know the overall impact of food fraud because so much of what fraudsters do is hidden from us and has been for centuries. 